We're out here at the site of the you know, Andrew Jackson Tavern on the Fox Park Farm that we're in the process of restoring and hopefully bringing it back to life. And when you're in a restoration project, whether it be an automobile or an old building or a piece of furniture or whatever it is, I think one of the key things you think about along the way is how much of the original are you going to try to keep and how much are you going to replace with new materials. And so we face that every day here on the Tavern Project. And one of the first uh, questions we had to answer was, since we weren't going to put on wood shingles as the original roof was, then where do we go from there? And of course, the only other option is to put on a tin roof. And then it becomes, do you do a new tin roof or do you do an old tin roof? And we happened, the tavern had a tin roof on it. And as you can see in the background, it was already rusted, a lot of the green paint was missing, so I don't know how old that roof was, maybe, you know, who knows, 20 years, 30 years, 50 years, whatever. So we chose to keep the old roof and we reworked it and we put the old roof back on, as you can see behind me. And what you see in an old roof is a piece of rusted tin. And of course, this is something that uh, is hard to achieve. There is a way to get new tin to look this way, but I don't know how to do it, and I'm not sure it would look like the original. So we chose to put the old tin on it, and this is the first look of it, and so I hope you like it looking this way instead of the shiny new, and we'll keep you up to date as we progress along with it. I think one of the interesting uh, aspects of the old tavern is uh, how they put the roof on. And we tried to save, you can see here, the rafters are made out of uh, cedar uh, saplings that they have flattened off on two sides. Uh, you can also see the lathing here. And above the lathing, you can see the wooden shingles. And these are the original wooden shingles that were put on the building in the early 1800s. And when when I bought the building, one side still had the original shingles on it and they've been covered with tin and, and several other types of roofing. Uh, one side was totally, uh, didn't have anything on it. So we saved these wooden shingles, so they're gonna be under the tin and under the felt paper. So generations from now, people can still see what the original shingles look like.